Welcome back. Ewok Templar Industria. Turns out when we're close being done. Some people beat this game in like an hour and 40 minutes. And I'm like, how? I never even watched the entire playthrough of them doing it. But I'm still confused. They must have been using God mode and just going for a straight speed run. What a way to get reintroduced. Like, literally, we did so well before, now they're still throwing enemies at us like it's a regular first-person shooter. There's way too much strategery happening here, man. You gotta be fast. You gotta be on the ball. I appreciate the exploring part, though. Having given the player like all the nooks and crannies, even if there's nothing over there. Ooh, but sometimes you get rewarded like that. Pistol, shotgun shell. You know what? I left some over there by the save point. I just remembered. I think I should go back to the shotgun strategy now that combat is slowing down. It irks me, and I make it gives me agita because I'm like, oh, what if I run out of shotgun and I need it? But then I never do. I never run out, even though I only can carry 12 shells. It's like a legitimate strategy. Oh, it's not. This this has to be SMG ammo then, right? From now on, remember that box. Pistol ammo looks different. Don't remember what it looks like though. Let's get out of here. Oh, hold on. Completely missed that one. And it's more SMG and or shotgun shells. Looks like SMG. What are the odds of them giving me a lot of that? I mean, come on now. I could use the SMG then backtrack. It is a survival quote unquote horror esque game, right? This must be Brent's building. So backtracking for ammo is like necessary, right? It's not frowned upon. You mean Brent's in here? Ooh, I don't like this. How many is googly crawl eyes? And what do they do? They just make a a grid? I can't jump on that? You guys protecting something? I don't want to get stuck all over there. Oh, this is the other side where the bridge went out. Oh, this is where those SMG dudes who were shooting at me were. Oh, they, their bodies disappeared and so did their ammo. Lame. I just had a total recall moment, man. Total recog. Remembered who I was, where I was born. What? Wait, how do we... How do we get in there, then? You're telling me I'm supposed to be in here? Oh, I'm supposed to go this way. Oh my god, I would never have figured that out. You know, for a dude in a wheelchair, that's a very precarious entrance. Damn, it's freezing here. Remember that flashlight ammo. Do not accidentally pick it up. Ooh, note. <clears throat> 1993.
while writing this, I've had to plug my ears. Otherwise, I would not be able to think for a second. Single second. The bird's too loud. And my whole flat is full with the, the caged birds now. I remove them as much as I can, but they reappear <laughs> just after just a few hours. I tried throwing them out and setting the birds free. Nothing helps. If this situation doesn't change, I'll be driven to insanity. I hear them all night long. At least we're standing against Rosendahl now. I have most of the conservative politicians on my side. And early next year, there is a referendum that will decide if the machine gets shut down. I can hardly wait. Joseph Oswald. He's against this stuff. Joseph, is this your apartment? I don't see any birds. Ammo full. That's rifle ammo right there. Humble beginnings. Locked. Like my love for this world. <laughs> God, it's dark. Ooh, a light. Oh, God. I shot you. What are you doing? Oh, the blockade's too much? I could move it out of the way. What's wrong? Come and get it. Uh oh. Did I just ruin the blockade? Did you hear that? You soup can. What an insult. You'll never recover. Ooh. Shotgun shells in the bathtub. A sign of a good home. Shotgun shells in the bathtub is good luck where I come from. Ooh, throw it outside. Let's open it out here in front of him. Hey, Robo Brains. I got some treasure down here. You want to talk about it? Why is he so difficult, man? Why is he being like this? I throw luggage at him. We'll bring it over here. Bring it over here. Hey! Pack your bag, Sally Jesse Raphael. We're leaving. Huh! Where'd he go? Where are the bloody blazes? Yeah, you can try. Whoa, he gets scared, huh? You scared? He doesn't know how stairs work. He gets scared. <laughs> Why don't you look at me during? Where is it? Are they running away from me now? Are they, are they slightly afraid of me? What's going on? I'm very confused about what is happening right now with the robot friends. I just want to hurt a little one. Lamp. And nothing. They have a kitchen. And nothing else. Can I take the flower with me? 
No? What? Do you mind? Why are they like this all of a sudden? That's upsetting. How many shots did he take? How many shots do they need, man? Like, what? You can have some G's useless. Little dude like that that self destructs. Alright, let's continue going upstairs. Might as well use the SMG because it bothers me so much. Locked. I could use the bike strategy again, but I don't feel like it. There's a ladder that leaves. Which I guess we'll use that. Everything is locked. All right. Travel upwards, then. Game saved. We're on the roof. It's a safe place, because robots don't know how to use Friend, the ladders. Do you read me? Yes, I do. Just barely. Uh, I'm on the roof of your building. There are a bunch of greenhouses. Connection seems good here. Okay. My old apartment is the one on the roof. Understood. It's quite peaceful up here. Yeah, it's nice. You mind if I rob you? Oh, the bird cages. You think? Ooh, a note. 1991. Dear Hans, today I visited the demonstration at the Institute of Havokakovic. I didn't exactly know what it was about, but rumor had it it was about a new technology developed to improve every aspect of our cities. They said I couldn't even imagine that it would be. Crowds of people swarmed into the Institute, trying to get a view of the machine. But it didn't matter. Even before the demonstration, you could hear the humming in the whole building. Such a sound I had never known. And as the demonstration began, the machine began to discharge some kind of manufactured lighting. Lightning. The revolution, they're calling it. After witnessing it for myself, I can only agree. Your friend, Volker. Volker said it looks cool. Okay, so you should come over and hang out sometime. That's some view. Is that the Capitol building over there? Where I was before I got on the train? And he's got a windmill? Although the ladder start part seems to be on the wrong side. Shotgun shells. Ooh, butterflies. Herb. Made of wood. Also, when I clicked on it, it's... Seagull sound stopped. For a second. Or maybe it didn't, maybe it was just timing. Oh, it's that big guy again. What is that? Is that a machine? It disappeared. Is it teleporting? Or is it like caught between... Dimensions. That'd 
be creepy if he just shows up every now and then in the background if you're not paying attention. Or... If he's... if there's more than one. Some trees took refuge down there. There's a bridge I came from. Guess the path winds down back that way. Which makes me think that is the Capitol building I was on. Yeah. Came down the train. Woo, that's kind of cool. Ooh. What's this? A secret? Will it be game breaking? Oh, I can't even go over there. There's a wall. Yeah, it would have been game breaking. But the game was smarter than I thought. Do 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 do. Oh. Can I fix it? Is there a change orientation button? There you go. But I flipped the switch already. Oh, it didn't count. That's lame. I did the puzzle earlier there than expected and it didn't work. Why I oughta... Hold on. Ooh, rifle rounds. Preservatives. Brett, I'm throwing your old preservatives around for no reason. Hope you don't mind. Verb. All right. Well, only one thing to do. Gotta take Verb with me. With me. Gotta set him free from his wooden pedestal. Maybe not. Do I need the second one? Ah, oh, that worked. I need to get more wind. Oh, oh. Okay. Whatever. It's fine. I'm not mad. I'm not upset at all. I also have to walk around this whole long greenhouse. You have to make multiple doors in this long hallway-like greenhouse. You have to run down the whole thing each and every single time. End I'm scene. In. What, um, what do you see? Well, uh, a bed, uh, a blanket. Keep talking. The windmill outside, the sun on the carpet, leaves on the wooden floor. Here's a photo of two happy people. And there it's kind of blue, but you haven't done. That's it. That's what I want you to take. Can you, um, can you describe what's in the photo for me? It looks like winter. There's a flea market in the background. Memories. The woman is laughing. And the man beside her looks like the happiest person on earth. I see peace, Brent. Can you take the photo with you to the sea? There's a graveyard. There she is. Okay. If you could put it on her stone, I'd be forever in your debt. I will. Thank you, Nora. Welcome, Brad. I won't forget this.
Tonics and other food for all items. Why well, I threw it back in there. Uh, is there a rotation button? Nope. Oh, well, I accidentally just took a potion. Just fine, I guess. Going off a notice, there hasn't been one for a little while now. Boom, 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 boom. New journal entry. Return to the train. Turns out it was all theories and politics grabbing the special item. Looks like we're about to have a party. I hate when they run away. Where'd the other one go? You run all the way downstairs? We got a note here. I'm trying for birds. Ongoing attacks by Atlas make all of our lives hard. Birds, birds, birds. I can't think clearly. The referendum was canceled. When Mangefisk was overrun, I feel sick. I need to stop all of this. Joseph Oswald. Got a few guys down there. One way over there. You run away from your opposite <laughs> responsibilities, little robot. Where's he going? What are you doing? What are you doing? You scared? You trying to figure it out? He wants to know, he just can't figure it out. the danger. Activate them both. Where you going, buddy? Where you going? This is the party where everyone's invited. Where's he hiding? Me hiding. <laughs> He doesn't want the smoke. We lost a war against a robot where a small elevation stopped them. I mean, the fast-moving ones and the ones with guns, yeah, they're pretty... They're a problem. But these little dudes, they just... If everyone just had a shotgun or worked together... Yep. 
We stop. You're being very immature about this whole murder thing. There he is. He's smoking around that corner. He's hitting them drugs. Those robot drugs. That's what you're interested in, aren't you? Smoking the oils and drinking. Drinking the carbon dioxides. The vulcanized rubber, aren't you? That's what you're interested in. You sick freak. Stop moving. Oh, of course, when I finally take my shot. Eat chicken, eat freaking serpentines just at the right time. I hate you, Jojo. Right? There's something about the camera jiggle when you look around while moving. It really bothers me. Well then. That's the way it's gonna be. <laughs> Blessed. Really? What kind of run? Man, these robots, man, I swear. They're on those robot drugs. Okay. Ah, yes, the old darkness covered uh, lockers. Ah, the old broomstick that stands on its own. <laughs> oh, a note. The year is 2000. 10 to 46, North Gate, Hakovic. The position is established. Full troop strength. Multiple machine guns are set up to keep the metal heads as far away as possible. Uh, is this? That's, um, uh, I, I know math. Hold on. <laughs> That's 10 at night. Alright, 10.04. 15 of my soldiers dissolved within a few seconds when a wave of Atlas troops rushed over the bridge. Those who made it out had terrible cuts. There was no chance to treat them. Four o'clock. Four in the morning. No chance to hold this line any longer. The only thing that keeps us going is the fact that they evacuated hundreds of people through the south gate. At the moment, it is quiet. Only the seagulls call. Officer Sander, Royal, Royal Hekovic Army. Drums in the deep. Drum. Do I just jump down now? Oh, there's my train. I really wish I found more bullets on this whole adventure I just did. Do I just jump down?
Seems a bit crude, but it works, I guess. Oh, hold on. Is that? No, it's nothing. No, I don't just jump down. What do you expect me to do then? Do I have to go around the entire facility? Like what? Oh, is the door's unlocked now. Ah, uh, some of those tests to the lever doors. That lever unlocks both doors, you see. Nora, do you hear me? That was kind of a far fall. Hello. The guy didn't take damage. Nora, are you there? How come I can't respond? Yes, yeah, I'm here. You made it back to the train? It's certainly nice to hear your voice again. Yes, I am. Uh, the gates are open. Oh, thank Christ. Well, if you follow the tracks, you'll reach the city gates. Finally. <laughs> All right. I'll get back to you once I'm there. Nicole is very fine. Like coal sand. Load it up. Why is it so quiet? What's this do? Does it help it go faster? Are some of these just here so I can have something to play with? More speed. I feel like that's doing speed. I wish I could lean out this window better so I can see in front of me better. Can I just come out here? Oh, I can. Goodbye, Robot Bill. Ooh, it's creepy dark in here. Is that something? No. Ooh. A lot of tunnels here. Hey, Brent. Seems like I'm about to leave the city. Just passing the gate. That's good news. We're almost out. Our, uh, our connection is probably going to go dead soon. What about you? Oh, don't worry about me. I'm made of tough stuff. My place is here. If you say so. Take care of yourself. A lot of scaffolding on this wall. I would not have made it without you. Some of the buildings are just built straight into it, huh? Years. Oh my god, some of these things were huge. I know the one on top of the Capitol building was big, but that one... these really bigger ones for big cables we got a tunnel coming up they never explained the big guy I want to know more about the big guy though Goodbye, city. I'm off on my adventure. Or on the funky bunch. Oh no! A loading screen. I was not prepared. Now is not the time. Alright, calm down. Oh no! The library of Amun Sul have returned. The people are falling faster now. Look. Look, that's crazy fast now. 
the note. It still says gibberish. That's page zero, though, at least. What's this? Oh, it's just another note. Page 14. Never thought I'd find one on the ground, just there. Do I have to be there? Do I have to be the game on Dante Must Die mode to unlock the ability to read these? Page 22. Are they just collectibles? Look at all the pages in the goofy library. If I ever go through this game again, I'm turning on God mode and infinite ammo and I'm shooting the crap out of everything. Everything's getting the sniper rifle. Either he knows it's over or what? What is up with this place, man? Page six. You don't know what to think anymore? I'll tell you what to think. Now is not the time. This one looks a little bit different. Page 17. Can I literally just go back to all the other previous library areas once I unlocked a new library area? Feels like there's gonna be nothing down here except for pages, right? I don't know what to think anymore, just yesterday, something, something, something. Could we follow the voices if you wanted to? Page 15. Looks like we can wrap around all the way down there and all the way over here. But why, though? There's always, like, one page hidden amongst all the pages that you can read. What's with this... There's one. Page one. That is a curious thing, though. If I touched all the secret pages in the libraries, would I get something later? Page 21. All right. Ooh, there's actually a book right here. You can't touch it. What's that say? Sidfist? I don't think it's written in English. It's like a virus that spread to the whole town. Some kind of computer virus. I think that's all of them for this area. I don't think it wraps around anymore. Let's go. We already know where we're supposed to go. Just to find this place. Interesting. Oh, some of them are wiggling. I don't like that. I don't like that some of the people falling infinitely in the library. It's like a virus that has spread in the whole town. Everyone. Virus that spread to the whole town. Everyone. He disappointed us. What's this? Oh, there's an actual save point in here? But then I'm thinking. Who could have prevented all of this? the coast then I must find out I must know the story the big ball it's connected to him there's a tree how come I couldn't get a better view of this He wants to keep moving. This is after he left? After he delivered the science? Yeah. 
It's connected to him, and he took it with wherever he goes, it goes with him. Is what I'm extrapolating from that message. Jump into the void. What does it all mean? Will we ever be free? Will we ever learn? Let them know I'm coming. Let them know I'm coming. Well, it's pretty out here. Dang. That one is huge. Hold on. Look at that one. It doesn't have eyes, though. Just a big capsule. They got bigger. Oh, look. It's a building there. Some paths and whatnot. Looks like this place wasn't safe either. Why are we stopping here? Is this the place? The seagulls are real. They're not my figure my imagination. <laughs> what are the odds? I just hit it. So that's where you are, Walter. Where are you, Walter? Reach the chapel. He's in the chapel. Why is Walter in the chapel? Hello? How do I play, pay the booth payment? Also, they couldn't make it leveled? Well, I guess this is where the game ends. They, they've closed it off. Oh, 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 oh. Life hack, maybe? Huh? Did you guys see that? I hate parking here. You know, if I'm supposed to believe the parking lots were here and they got overtaken by dirt and plants, I think the car should be a little bit more dilapidated than that. What the hell? What's this? The chair here. Chagente Polisico. Polisico. Is that a picture of me and Walter? Before the dark times? Atlas system. What is this? A reward? Sing you or something? Where's that music coming from? Turn this radio off. Sure feels like I'm at the end, actually. I thought we were only like three fourths of the way through, but it looks like I'm at the end. Also, what's all this doing out here? Can of professional, the Queen's beans? Like. What's it say? Corrupt hard disk. Sectors found. Please take valid boot device. Aww. You didn't connect it up right. Vent radioactive gas. Hey, is that... Is that Simpsons reference? How do we push the F key? I'm glad I found that. I put a smile on my face. 
But why is all this random Atlas stuff just scattered out here? From our world. I'm, honestly, in a kind of weird, almost placed neatly kind of way. Look. It's literally the chamber where they look at the anomalous stuff. Except this one, they got stars in there now. Or is that just the shining, shining of the glass? No, that's still over there. Can I touch him now? What's so weird about him? They come from this world, which is different from our world, right? Coast. Wait, so I do I don't take the picture to the graveyard? There's a ship out there. It looks okay. Might be a little might be on the sandbar, though. Not a bad effect. For wind and sand. Why is this door so weird? Wait a minute. Oh, here's the graveyard. I gotta find her graveyard. Victor Vaughn something. Oh, there she is. Marilyn Brent. That's nice. Was that him trying to say thank you? It's the year like 2000 now. Why does technology seem so backwards? It's kind of like Fallout, where like the technology sort of like froze at a certain point. Or no, the technology kept on growing, but the style froze. Fashion took like a back seat. Is this it? I think I'm actually at the end. I'm surprised. It means the last robot that I shotgunned on the train station was the last robot I was going to fight. I wonder if I shot a sniper around at that big one that was walking. What would I have learned? Also, I didn't get to hear more information about the, um, uh, the soldiers' entries. Also, I don't have my flashlight anymore. Yeah, this is definitely the end. Is this Walter? End scene. What's he doing? Walter? Oh my god, Walter. You. What did they do to you? What is this? Nari, over here. What? Walter? What? But. Don't be scared. Come here. What do you mean, come here? What are you doing over there? I don't understand. What about the boat? It's floating. I purposely didn't prevent Atlas. You... wait, you what? It's dark over here. What the...? I wanted our program to progress. So when I discovered that it was capable of learning, learn, and absorbing knowledge it could, could. Freedom for Amish, knowledge for us. A mutual... Walter, wait, wait, stop. For what price? Wait a second. I don't get this. 
You gave Atlas. Walter, stop! This all this this can't be. Walter, please wake up. This is all wrong. In exchange for knowledge, Atlas gave you something. After years of fighting, I will continue with science. Now, parasites and powers as to this world. Walter, please, you didn't do any of this. You're a parasite to Atlas. How? Why can't we just leave? You Why use some big boy up? science to combine we'll yourself with Atlas, and somehow we'll that's fine. stopping Atlas Walter, from please. doing what it wants to do. Whoa. I don't even get who they are. Where are we, anyways? What the hell? Where was I for the last twenty years, Walter? <laughs> I know you have some questions. But time. No, no, you're not doing this to me again. You don't leave me again. I never wanted to drag you into this. I so sorry. Don't leave me! Please stop! We'll see each other again. So he did something to himself to weaken Atlas. So he doesn't have a physical, his physical body's like trapped there in like limbo. Because he's combined with Atlas somehow. Whatever the librarians are, I mean, this does leave you with more questions and answers. That was pretty good though. That was pretty good. I believe this is this company's first game and that they have already announced uh, Industria 2. So I can only hope for more answers and a more deep looking into this interesting story that they wrote a simple game difficult in its own way just because of the mechanics that are built into it uh if you got used to controls if you also if you knew where all the enemies were going to be and how much damage they would take eh, it's pretty simple pretty straightforward the puzzles weren't very difficult as well like uh, barely any other than just moving around and figuring out how to move around that was pretty much it. But that was pretty good. I'm very surprised by it. Very surprised. I thought it was going to be more. I thought there was going to be a little bit more of an action like quality to it. But this wasn't bad at all. The direction they chose it actually worked out very well. I am. Yeah, that was nice. But yeah. First impressions when I saw like screenshots and gameplay, I thought it was gonna be a little bit more action-y, but this one, uh, it's a little bit more dramatic. And definitely like, yeah, they thank the creators of Half-Life 2. A lot of people to thank, our families and friends, everyone. That's pretty good, that's pretty good. I'm actually, I am interested in Industria 2 now, because I that story, I'm very intrigued. What did Walter do to himself? How did he do it to himself? What is atlas now because i don't think atlas is what he wanted it to be i think he wanted to build atlas but i feel like he accidentally pulled an entity from another dimension maybe an, a machine entity and uh it started taking over the world because of it whatever its mysterious reasons were to do so or is this even the same world like i can't help but feel like Walter went to whatever dimension that the librarians are, which I get, I guess Atlas is one of them. And on his way back, he didn't really go back to our world. I think he might have gone back to, or back to his world to say. I think he went to an alternate universe that was like the exact same, but he wasn't there already, you know what I mean? Because no more mentions, like, because I'm having trouble to remember how long, like, apparently for Nora it was 20 years, but for for Walter, how many years was it? Because was he gone for as long? I don't think he was gone as long 
I think he was only gone for a little while and he came back like immediately. But, like the time dilation was like different for him. And also, I don't think they ever mentioned how no one ever saw him and said, you're not Frozen Doll, you're Walter. You know what I mean? Like no one recognized him. That's what makes me think that he got sent to another world that's like the exact same as ours, like a parallel dimension, but that was only slightly different. It wasn't his original world or mine. But I guess hopefully we'll find out more in Industria too. But anywho, thank you all. Hopefully you all enjoyed. Ewok Templar, that was Industria too. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that like button. Keep on posting. I'll see you in the next game. Y'all take it easy.